Hey Zach, Alex out here at Jones. Hope all has been well. Uh, Joe, let me know that you're looking for something with a little bit more room than the Acadia and the Enclave is it. So still very maneuverable. Doesn't feel like you're driving a, uh, you know, a, a large SUV or a truck or anything like that. But um, first things first, most important is gonna be the cargo space. So this is the Avenir, so the top trim level, similar to what the Denali would be in the, uh, in the Acadia side of things, but much more room. So you can see, you know, probably about another foot in uh, cargo room on the sides and then this massive storage compartment down underneath for odd and end items you might not need every day. Now this one does have the power folding third row or second row as well. And then of course hands-free power lift gate. Now, still going to have the same 3.6 V6 that you're used to in your Acadia. So, plenty of get up and go. In the second row here, see, so still slides forward and backwards to make the best room out of the leg space. Tons more room in between the, uh, the captain's chairs. And then a good amount more leg room in the third row, as well as an additional third seat in the uh, third row as well. Now this one in particular does have the heated seats in the second row as well as its own uh, climate control. Plenty of charging ports throughout the vehicle, very similar to what you're used to there. This one does have the dual sunroof. The exclusive Avenir wheels, still keyless entry. All the uh, safety features. The Avenir comes exclusive with the uh, kind of that honeycomb grill up front, setting it apart from the rest of the Enclaves. Now a couple other features that you may not be used to with your current Acadia. We'll jump on inside here. Again, a little bit more room, a little bit more shoulder room between the driver and the passenger. First things first, you have your 360 view that can be switched back into a standard mirror, but that gives you a 180 view behind you, uh, basically alleviating any blind spots that are uh, that can be obstructed with uh, any passengers in the back or cargo. Um, you also have your surround vision camera. So once I close the door here, you'll see it gives you a top-down 360 view around the entire vehicle so you know you're lined up and then a ton of other different camera angles wide angle lenses top down over hood and trunk top looking back anti-curb cams this one having the tow package you've got a top down overview for the hitch dual zone climate still up front here you, st you have your heated and ventilated seats as well as a heated steering wheel uh, both driver and passenger are going to have power seats. In addition to that, you're going to have four-way lumbar support as well as massaging seats uh, just in the first row here. So definitely great for those longer hauls. And then a lot of the additional safety features like your adaptive cruise control, lane keep assist, side blinds and alert, um, forward collision and low speed forward braking um, comes equipped with all those. Um, so I hope that this was helpful. Um, I know a lot of our Acadia customers and even some of our Yukon customers have actually switched to this for that additional cargo room. I know it won't disappoint, so I'd love to have you back out. Um, we're definitely in need for some uh, very well-kept Acadias. So uh, yeah, I hope you found the video helpful and look forward to seeing you soon.